Hey, what's up everyone? Dust Bunny Vegeta here from Slackers looking for bringing you Nino Kuni 2. Back at it again. Alright. Oh, controller. Controller. Work with me, controller. Yeah, so last time we had just made our way to the woods to find the master of the forest. I'm pretty sure I saved by the woods again. Close enough. Was on for a little bit, just playing around. It did a little off-camera grinding, because uh, we haven't really had any issues thus far, but being that it is a JRPG, you will. I, I've never not played a JRPG and not had issues that required a little bit of grinding to, to sort out, so just nip that in the bud. Got a couple hours, uh, a couple, a couple hours, <laughs> yeah, a couple hours of grinding. No, uh, a couple levels. I have to fight this guy because he's right here. Right, we're just gonna find him. Should have saved back in the tree where we left off, but I don't know why I did. I think maybe because it was like nothing. six in the morning. Oh snap! I unlocked a new skill with him. Oh, he has a dark skill. Sweet. Yeah, more or less, I was just trying to get our other characters that we got about on par with our mains, since our mains were about three to four levels above that. And see, now we're across the board. I didn't have to go in there. 17, 18, 17. I believe... For some reason, I thought that was... I'll do that my was best. the captain. Ah. Take the back. Hey, pork chopper. Whoa! Yeah, you know, you are not fun to play against. I'm using a steam controller for controls. It was everyone? That was everyone. Ice. Loot! Man, I hope we use all this loot, because... We're getting all sorts of like crystals and strings and everything that I just don't have any reason to. That's why the game looks all funky to me. One sec, while this is loading, I'll fix this. Forget that I uh lower the brightness at night when the missus goes to bed because I don't want to wake her up while I'm working on stuff. Obviously, I'm like, man, this game is really dark. Okay, that's only fixing it, probably from my end, not for you guys, but let's go ahead and just top off our HP and our... Yeah, go ahead and save it, just... I don't know what's in here. If something kills me, I'd rather just start right back at this point and not outside again. So we're speaking to Niel, Master of the Forest. We find him. And this would have been a much better place to grind last night, but no. I didn't want to, well, I didn't want to venture in here at all and, uh... Oh man, that's a nice AoE. But not as, oh my god. Stop. Oh, I'm confused. <laughs> Throw me heals, buddy-o. Tiny squirrels? Oh man, they give HP when you kill them. Nice. Me just have to stick to normal sword attacks. I mean, I am boosted for sword attacks, so not really a magic user. Good to know we have a magical range, though. I don't know where this goes. You going up and around? Oh, there, there are big baddies up here. Got him, we got him, yeah. Nice. Easy peasy. 
will say the transitioning between battle and not battle for the overworld is kind of rough. But, I mean, it, it's it's nice and easy because when you kill them, all your loot is just like in a circle and you're like, ah, la, 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 loot. Here, you gotta go pick it all up. I wonder if there's a way to get a, uh, a loot vacuum later on. What be you? Small mushrooms growing here if they were big. Oh, okay. We've seen this before, so maybe we're gonna get the key item that lets us get through that. Gotta be cool. Oh, I see you. Alternate path. Hey, just. Da -da 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 Potion. That's just decorative. Wait. Oh, there's a chest over here, too. I ah, I'm stuck. What was that? Oh, rice. Hey, dice dumplings. No, 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 no. That was a rice rump. Ri a rice rumpling. I know what a rice rumpling is. That's. Leave, leave me. I haven't had coffee today yet. One should never record in the morning. Got caught. Happy to survive. What? Oh, hey. Hey, you're alive. Sorry about that. Sorry for giving you the false hope that you were going to make it out of here alive. Okay, like for real. Where do I go? Can I just jump down? I can't jump down. So. So, yeah, okay. I had to mess, missed a path up here. Oh, there's people here. That would have been great for me to see. <laughs> Oi! They're not quite people. Please, you have to let me work here. You just have to. <sighs> Ugh, well, it's not that simple, you see. Huh? What's going on here? Gosh. Looks like they're having some kind of argument. Some kind of disagreement. <laughs> argument, disagreement. Same thing. Listen. We've no need of such things. I'm sorry. I didn't know how else to say it. Oh. No need for delicious fresh bread? Impossible. You won't regret it, I promise. Please, you have to give me a chance. It's a cat. Excuse me. Is is everything all right here? Well, it's a little awkward to be honest. The young fella here, he, he wants to be Master Nail's personal chef, and he will want to take no for an answer. I don't know why these guys have this accent. Let's just go with it. They're country bumpkins. I most certainly will not. I came here to work, and that's what I'm going to do. <coughs> Whoa! Wait, 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 wait! King Evan, you're alive. I see you a Grimalkin. Did you come all this way from Ding Dong Dale? Uh, yeah, 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 yes, your majesty. The name is Floyd. I was training to be a chef back home, but then the coup happened. And... Well, if you're looking for a place to live, you're more than welcome to come to my new kingdom. We're going to build it out in the hotlands. <laughs> really? Uh, it would be ever so helpful. I was starting to get a little desperate. Yes, I could be your court chef. We got as far as learning how to make bread, but it's ever, it's, it's ever such good bread. I'm sure I'll learn more recipes soon. That sounds perfect. I shall look forward to finding out what delicious things you can come up with. Wonderful, the Heartlands, was it? All right, I'll head there straight away. <laughs> Watch out for the millions of mobs on your way. Thanks. Don't touch those purple glowy ones, man. Thank you so much, dear Majesty. I'll see you in the new country. Ah, oh, new country soon. My new country soon. No, he's not gonna do a coup. Let's hold on. All right, all right, all right, just go. Go, go make your bread. Oh, heavens. Oh, you really saved our bacon there, laddie. Oh, they are Scottish. Excuse me. Uh, all right. 
We were worried you'd never get rid of the stubborn wee blighter. Yeah. Yeah, here to see Master Niao, presumably. Well, it was certainly not refused here in the audience after that little favor. Through you go now. Look, my Scottish is bad. You'd think as an Irish guy I'd be able to do a decent accent. I can't. I'm sorry. Closest Scottish I can do is Shrek. Speaking of Shrek. Who are you? <laughs> I don't know why that makes me laugh that he actually... Okay. Let me get this straight. You're wanting to chop down a load of our trees and cut them off so you can make your daft wee kingdom bigger. Mm. Yes. <laughs> Good luck with that, pal. Next time, instead of sending some snotty wee action to do his dirty work, tell your king to come and task me himself, eh? I am the king. Oh, I. Oh, hi! You think I was born yesterday? Nope, I speak to your king and none other. I'll make no promises even then. I said, I am the king. He is. This is the kingmaker right here. Howdy do! Help my boy! Get away with you! I met kings before, they've a sudden. Something about them. Dignity, you can. Gravitas, if you will. A touch of class. Oh. You, you don't see any of those things in me. Hi. He's a very good king, I'll have you know. He used to be the ruler of Ding Dong Dale, but then some mice overthrew him. Oh. Now he's trying to build a whole new king. You're not helping the situation where you're like, some mice overthrew you. Yeah. Crack you, blimey! That's a right hard tale, so you're telling me uh, you're young Evan, the lad they were saying perish in the troubles over the way. It's not Scottish anymore, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's all well and good. I love a bit of drama as much as the next man, but I cannot give you what you need. Aunt Puggy's the one you want to speak to. Impugnatious? Gopa? Who's that exactly? The Grand High Roller they call the Grand High Roller they calls him. Boss man over in the neck of the woods. King of Gold Pie, you might say. Aye. Aye, that's the fella. Invited me over for we shake of the odd dice, and before I knew it, I'd lost me shirt. So I did what anyone would. I popped the fathers down as collateral on one last roll and it didn't exactly go my way. Now his flunkies are tramping through my lovely woods, sticking nonsense on trees, and trying to boot me out of my behind, the heartless devils. So those things on the trees, they're eviction notices. Which means the forest of Niall is now the forest of Pugnacious. And now inkling you've been built, old timer. The game's over in Good Pass, said to be rigged to beggary. Aye, that they are. I'm, I'm, I'm so... Crooked has a dog's hiding leg, the lots of them. Hmm. A head of state fixing dice games. If it's true, it's quite the scandal. I have a proposition for you, Neil. We need wood. Lots of wood. We get your forest back, will you give us what we need? Are you joking? If you get my forest back, I'll chop the trees down myself. Alright. Alright, it's a deal. If that's all right with you, Evan. Yes. Of course. Poor Niall is in trouble. If we can further our cause by helping him, that's all the more reason to try. We help him, and then we use him beyond uh, his beliefs to get further in our own conquest. To take over the world. Let's go to Gold Paw, shall we? There's glowy shit all over his house. Yo, give me your glowy shit. Oh, boy. Yeah. So I, I really gotta jump. Oh. No, 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 no. 
Now, 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 now. I don't know if I can. It's just, he's just got gold over his house. What the, what the deal? He's, he's just got gold all over his house. Okay. I see how it is. Hey, a warp. Baby. Pine drip door. Head for gold pie. Which I assume is to the left. Yes. Uh, we're really close to 19. Let's Watch pull this backs. big ass group. <laughs> Not get hit by the things he's raining down, but still get hit by the things he's raining down. Don't let me down. Yeah, I love the look of that skill. Yeah, I, we are like so close to to 19 on this guy. Oh, man, toadstools, money, a comb of runny honey. Doesn't sound that peas uh, appeasing. Runny honey. Which wrong with you, runny honey? You got the runs. That, that, ignore me. We just start over. Hi, everyone, I'm Dustman. Hi, Tin. So we've been about 15 minutes so far. Let's see. Blah, 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 about. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll run about 240. Try not to do crazy long episodes. I know people have kind of got on me about that. Like, hey, this episode was an hour and a half long. Like, well, you see, I get caught up on what I'm doing. Before you know it, it's been too long. No, 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 no. Dang it. Yeah! Do your worst! Eat this! Ow! Jerk! Got me! Got me! Ah! I, used to, I know. I like that skill only because that. It's actually garbage, but. I don't have. Much. What the heck did you just hit him with? Jeez. I don't have much range damage on this guy. I feel like maybe I can set range damage up at some point. But for now, it's all sword damage. Oi! You sure it's a good idea making a uh -huh. noise like that? Making a deal like that? Yeah, we'll figure something out. Besides, I doubt there's much. Thank you, game! Much something else that we can do to for something somewhere. Yeah. I mean, not to be that guy, but we're a tiny king with a band of essentially marauders uh, trying to take over the world. I mean, essentially that's what we're doing. We're, we, we are on a path for world domination. So yeah, we're gonna use every chance we get to use, you know, means to win in, folks. Means to win in. It's like the King's Leon song. You gotta use somebody, someone like you. Be -be -be. Okay. But yeah, we're gonna use everybody we can. Stand on the heads of the little man. I mean. Granted, we're gonna help people out on the way, cause we seem to be a good gang. I don't trust that big slime out there. Wait, that's ocean. How do we... Okay, we're gonna get ocean travel at some point, and those guys are gonna be a problem. I'm calling it. I'm calling it right now. Mag... I thought that was said Mana Marco. I'm like, that's... That's Elder Scrolls. Mag slime. Oh man, they look like flans. I like Final Fantasy flans, though they do. They look like a yummy creme brulee. Yo, I'm doing a 
gonna go get a flan after this episode. Got some coconut flan in there the missus made. Yee. It's delicious. Oh, I ever tried coconut flan before. That is big. Okay, we gotta figure out how to open up these locked chests at some point as well. I wonder if there's a like a perk we get later, maybe a character. Maybe it's based off of killing the 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 dark bosses in each area. Maybe you get a key from them. I'll I don't do really know. Snap, <laughs> son. You guys just got creamed. You guys just got whamstered. I'm not wrong. A damp ranger's bow. It's probably plus water damage on our range. I like it. We do it. That guy looks just a normal enemy. What is with this? It's like a sand. Yeah, one of those Zen gardens. The sand and stuff? That's what this looks like. Did I cheat? Ha <laughs> Cheated. Excuse me? Anyone else see that? What was it? I can't do it again. Okay, okay. I'll have to look at the recording later for that. It looks like gold paw off the distance. No, no, no. Ooh, warp point, babe. Now, travel to Comlands Trip Door, aka teleporting, because magic. But, but, please let me go. Ah. Not worth it. And the ultimate weapon has been left behind. Oh, we'll, okay, we'll go this way. I feel like we gotta go that way anyway for the bridge. It's gonna be another like potion. You watch. It's sleep be gone. So remove sleep. It's a sleep anti-sleep potion. Ooh. Looks like a giant. From here, it looks like a Japanese building. Oh man, I, I I love those like Kyoto style buildings. They're they're great. They're awesome. I remember being a huge fan of them back in. Uh, few ones played the original Guild Wars. Guild Wars One. Not that I don't love Guild Wars Two. I do. I just haven't played it in a while. But the. Come on. One of the. One of the DLCs. My, my brain's farting on exactly which one. It was all, like, stylized Asian culture and stuff. I, beautiful, beautiful stuff. Uh, come, on, come, on, come on, come on. Little flame guy, let's go. Oh. Fire incarnate, I do not like you. You do pay out with a lot of loot, though. I like that. Give me all your loot. Mm. Alright. I'm gonna have to kill this guy just to get back up there. Not. Maybe not. However, can I access that from over here? No. This is a all the way around type chest. Oh, no, uh, maybe. How did you get over there? Seriously? You know, the, the mapping in this game is weird. Ooh. Hot streak spicy noodles. When you're the new... When you're in the nude for spicy noodles, choose hot streak. When you're in the mood, 
<laughs> when you're in the nude. I do not recommend eating spicy noodles in the nude. Yep, gold paw. Uh, it's gonna be like cats, dogs, or foxes. Probably a fox since they outfoxed our Neal man. Gosh. Flippin' heck! I heard Gold Paw was showy, but blimey. Mm -hmm. In it though. Beautiful, in it. Got a feeling I'm gonna like this place. Them there's casinos make a fortune from all the easy marks that come flooding. The gates and droves. It all goes straight into the government's pocket, state owned, see? So the government runs the casinos, huh? Guess we better go find Pugnacious. Mm hmm. Yes, I'm sure if we ask him nicely, he'll soon see sense and let Niall have his far as back. Bullshit alert, but whatever, Evan, you're naive. You're, you're new. I'm not exactly where to just look for him. It'll be the big castle looking thingy up the top of the town there, won't it? That's where a grand hire ever lived to me. Uh huh. Here we go, place to start as any. Let's set up there and see what we can see. And then he's going to have a problem, and then we're going to have to fix his problem to fix the other person's problem to fix the other person's problem to fix the other person's problem to fix the other person. JRPG. Done. Alright. We got five guilders. Somebody lost money over here. We're good. Any doors? A couple people we can talk to. Mm. Must remember this allow, uh... Must remember to allow ladies to pass on the right. My fortune teller told me that this was the best way of becoming luckier in love. Oh, we got we got a fortune teller. We could talk to him, her at some point. Okay. So all these shops are for show, it looks like. Yes. I right, except for you. Welcome. Sweet saffron tea house. You video. Mm. Hey, we get rice rumplings. <laughs> Victor's volcano, a dish resembling magma, not only in color, but fortune favors the bold. Nice. Peachy players punch. Money? We only have five thousand dollars. We we can buy on, ten meals. I'll be That's seeing it. you again soon. Will you be seeing me again soon? Am I coming back to you? Maybe. I I might I might <gasps> come back. Oh, smell Rain. that. Yeah, you're not eating anything, Evan. It's too expensive. 500 gold. Do you know how long it would take us to get 500 gold? That's like 9 or 10 battles to get 500 gold. Hey, a pebble. Sweet. Piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. I... Oh, I'm running around picking up all these things because... They're all around the same junk. They always gonna come back and haunt me later. And I'm like, oh, it's just junk. It's, it's gonna be like, I need one junk to continue this mission. Sackcloth. I, it, it's overload. There's just so many items all the time. Item, 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 item. Also, I've already lost track. Oh, where the heck am I supposed to be going? I think it's this big one over here, right? Hello, lady. Yeah. I'm gonna read the stars like Master Pugnacious. It's his talent that's made gold ball so prosperous, you know? I have the feeling there's some sort of sneaky thing behind this. Maybe he's got a kingmaker that's not really a kingmaker, just uh Maybe he's just cheating everyone and nobody knows the actual truth. Who knows? Uh, I, oh, don't stand on that. Don't jump off, Evan. It's dangerous. Yeah, this is definitely leading on to something big. You're a little young hey. to be here. Do you know why the statue of Lady Luck has its mouth open? Because it's screaming. No, I do. 
It's because it is talking to the fates and asking them to bring good fortune to Goldball. It's true, my father told me. Your father the bad. No, he's, he's, he's fine. Gosh. Yeah. Oi. Aye, that it be. I have a mind to pop in and see what's going on. With my money in my and our face. Let's go. Can we go? Oh, we can go. Mm. Oh. Want to gamble. Why, why you don't let me gamble? So much coral pink thread. Dude, this area is crazy. Hey, do you got those, like... Ah! I can find sushi around here. Didn't I just find one of these? That's a big statue. Maybe it's a kingmaker. What's all the noise, I wonder? Sounds like a festival of some sort. It's a festival every day. All the time. Please kill us. You've come at a most auspicious time, friends. Today is the day on which Lady Lux died decides the taxes for the month to come. Should she roll a one, we will pay no taxes at all. Really? Not at all? Hmm. Alas, for the last two months, she's rolled sixes. And what happens then? <sighs> the taxes increase sixfold. Holy moly. What? You're joking. Has anyone's... How is anyone meant to afford that? It is hard, young lady. But such are the vagaries of fortune, and without fortune... What is gold paw? I cannot say a one would not be welcome. Taxation based on a dice roll? Isn't that a little irresponsible? It is our way, and besides, it's not fun to trust all to fortune? To place one's fate on a single roll of the die? No. Even our criminal trials are held in this way. Guilt or innocence are decided by the judgment of the die. Oh, man. What? Wow, that sounds risky. Indeed, but those blessed by fortune have nothing to fear. Hmm? Now, Spugnatius is here. The ceremony is beginning. Oh. He's quite literally a pug. Is he really just a big fat pug? Lady of fortune, may luck be on our side this month. He is a pug. Huh? <laughs> 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 the taxes of the month will increase six full. Tighten your belts and trust the lady luck. Fellow citizens, gold paw all will be well. Another six, and I was certain that our luck had turned. Oh, uh, oh well. All is uh, as the Mistress of Fortune wills it. So that was Master Pugnacious. Yeah, if what the kid said was true, he's been rolling nothing but sixes the past three months. Oh, flippin' heck. Well, that's not right, is it? The whole thing must be rigged. Listen here. We're well, not getting... We'll not get far making such accusations without proof, girlie. We'd best go see the man himself. He's in the big building, right? The Grand High Rollers Hall. I mean, we should have permission to go check it out because mm, we're technically royalty. When I say technically, technically we're royalty. Only those with business may enter. Now, sent us. We have urgent business with the Grand High Roller. Master Pugnacious is occupied. He will see no one. But, but... But it's important. Mention you're a king, dumbass. No one. Say. But we play you for the chance to see him. Put the decision in the hands of the Mistress of Fortune. Game of dice. Very well. Well, if you win, you'll have to, uh, you'll have your audience. If you lose, you will pay me. I think we accept those terms. 
Excellent. I will make ready. Gather together what money you would wager and speak with me again. Oh, please. Do we have to actually... 1,000 guilders. You may pay after what you prefer, of course. Shall we begin? Oh, hmm. boy. We shall play a round of red and black. The game uses three dice. We'll throw two of the dice, and you will confirm the numbers rolled. We'll then decide whether the roll of the third dice will bring the total of all three to 11 or more. Or if it will be less. If you believe it will be 11 or more, you shall call red. If less, black. Red more, black less. However, when three ones are rolled, or three sixes, red and black will be turned on their heads. By this we mean, despite the total of three, our three ones will count as red. By the total of eight, our three sixes will count as black. Um, yeah. Huh. Slightly in our favor, if anything. Well, no. Fine set of dice. There's a fine set of dice, though, matey. They'll be worth a pretty penny, I shouldn't wonder. <laughs> Keep your filthy hands away from them. It's a sacred item, trusted only to the highest ranking servants of the realm. Let us begin. I will start by rolling the first two dice. Hmm. Six and a one. Uh, seven. Total of seven. Well, do you call red or black? Shoot. I mean, seven would mean you would need four, five, or six to beat to be 11 or higher. 4 being 11, 5 or 6 being higher, and then a 1, 2, 3 to be less. Damn, that is a bad spread. I mean, it's even. Oh, it's going to cost me a thousand bucks. I'm going to say black, 10 or lower. Oh, 10 or lower. Hold up. So that would have been, yeah, one, two, three. So I need a one, two, or a three, babe. Jeez. Red is victorious. You've lost. <sighs> My condolences, young man. You were lucky indeed, however. But beware, should a third one appear, red and black will be turned on their heads. Well, what do you call it, red or black? I mean, if he gets a one, then we know the game's rigged. Because well. the chance is low. Son of a gun! <laughs> really? Oh my god, how much? I'm just blowing all of my money. <laughs> Roland's over here like, I got Double sixes. No, 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 no. Let's go on black here. Unless he's flat out Very cheating. Well. Okay, I'm, I'm walking away from this. Ha! Uh, this, 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 this. Oh, come on! Says so Levin, are you complete numbskull? Give up! But, but. I'm doing so well. You're not, you're, you're not. Excuse me? 
This town has to hand over the ten million guilders. Snakes alive! Which is only a thousand a minute ago. Here's <laughs> Jake Rose. Official loss it increases a hundredfold. One thousand rises to a hundred thousand, which rises to mid jeez. But not the amount I would exactly You mentioned the debt, but not the amount I I wouldn't exactly call that the informed consent. Oh my very well. It will allow you to delay the payment of your debt. Huh? <laughs> oh, do not be alarmed. The creature will leave you when your debt is paid. <laughs> we have a crazy bird that, that follows us around and yells at us sweet. Of course, there was no leaving that table. I mean, it, it said, of course, of course, and then I will never lose again. So this is scripted, but still. No closer to being Master Pugnacious. Now we owe two million guilders in debt. You owe me! You owe me! Kill the bird! Kill the bird! Core, half the flipping town must be in debt if all these birds have anything to go by. So about that dice game, I couldn't help noticing something fishy about how the third die was moving. You spotted it too? I was thinking exactly the same thing. Mm -hmm. Really? It was a loss in the game there, so let me notice, I have to say. Hmm. It wouldn't surprise me if there were more to that die than meets the eye. The swab said they were special dies only for big wigs or some such, did he not? If we get our hands on that on one, we might be able to find some proof that he was cheating. Let me take a look at the casino. Government runs it right, so it'd be full of government employees and dice. Motion seconded it. Third. So let's not gamble here because they all you cheat. You owe me! You owe me! We're eating bird tonight, folks. Eating bird. I, I hope you just yell at me randomly while I'm traveling around. Please. Dare you to yell at me. Yell at me, bird! What up, casino friend? That's a fancy casino. Hmm. My humblest apologies, sir. The house kindly asks for those who are, uh, troubled by debt to refrain from playing. Oh. Ah, I see, of course. He's with me. I won't let him play any of the games. He'll just be watching. Is that alright with you? By all means, we hope that you enjoy our visit. Vision for enjoy your visit. Alright. So that's what the inside of a casino looks like. We'll draw a less ginger we split up. Let's spread out and see what we can see. Roland says that a lot. Let's see what we can see. Let's see what we can see. Let's see what we can see. Let's go see what we can see. See, see, <laughs> see what we see. We have places like this back home, too. Get some things are the same no matter where you go, huh? Everybody's got a bird. Ba -ba 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 bird, 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 bird. Seems you are burdened with debt. I'm not sure we are. You owe me! You owe me! There's a dude there with a the quest icon. Come here, buddy. What you got? Hmm, you want? You wish to know more about the dice they hear? They use it here. The case. Uh, I can't talk. I can quite understand why you would. I suppose you have been wondering at the uh, admiring glances bestowed upon the bearers of these suspicious items. Yes. <sighs> As they're only granted the select servants of the realm, you will not find them on sale anywhere, I'm afraid. Not even I, a citizen of the Red Nation, would be able to obtain one. I would have given up on my dreams of owning one if I were you. Hmm, what is the mo most remarkable quality of the casino, you ask? Hmm. Suppose it was the croupiers more than anything. 
They are all but impossible to outplay. No matter how good one hand's, one's hand may seem, they always seem to find one way to turn the tables. You must be blessed with inexhaustible reserves of good fortune. There's no reason to give up. If I, too, pay regular obs obsessions to Lady Luck, the tide of fate will surely turn in my favor eventually. So the croupiers have really, really, really good luck and nobody thinks this is a thing. <laughs> ah, there's plenty of fun to be had in places like this, Evan lad. I have spent an hour or ten in here if you let me. If you made money, man, I'm not gonna complain. It's not uncommon for visitors to our kingdom to loudly decry the casino as a den of trickery. <laughs> but this is a ridiculous assertion. Do they not understand that it is owned and operated by the state? Surely they do not think the powers that be intervene to ensure that the dice always fall in their favor? Such behavior would be a front of Lady Luck, our holies of holies. If you ask me, such complaints are nothing more than the whining of sore losers. You mean, you 100% believe that your government isn't lying to you? Ignorance, I say, ignorance. Hope the others manage to be helpful as well. Well, now. Well, what do you know? The dice they use in here are the same ones that our friend the gatekeeper had. It seems they really are a little fishy. I. Ar. I be the proof of that lad. This place is as crooked as a wyvern's grin. Money! No! Oh, come on! You didn't, did you? Oh, did you, Big Wally? <laughs> I couldn't help myself. Stand by and watch a while. There'll be fun to be had. There ain't me wig, girly. Okay. How much did you lose exactly, if you mind me, uh, a little pry? Considering how big his bird is. Ah, mere pennies, little fella. Mere pennies. Ah. Uh. So I want to show you. I can't do it here, though. Should we take it somewhere a little quieter? Sure. Are you 18? How about the end? Okay, good. We don't actually have two birds yelling at me the entire time. Uh, this way. Oh my gosh, the size of that bird. We have a skinny. Hey. Must pass through the 100 times where I'm doomed to never taste victory. The Money! That is the fattest do bill I've ever seen. Get another, gather everyone on the lobby of the inn and see what Tani has to tell you, show you, tell you. Probably the one place in this establishment that doesn't earn as much money as everyone else. Welcome, dearies, welcome. Would you possibly borrow the lobby for a moment or two? Yes. By all means, my lovely, by all means, take all the time you need. <laughs> I'm gonna debunk your religion real quick. Um, so Tani, what was it you wanted to show us? <laughs> your favorite little scallywag only went and swiped himself for dice. Huh? You mean you stole one? So borrowed, whatever helps you sleep at night. Wait, well, I've got something very interesting to show you. Watch this. If I press the one, we get a one. And if I press the five, a five. <laughs> now two. Beginner's luck. Oh, cheeky oh, well. beggars. So that's it. Uh huh. That's how they've been doing it, huh? <laughs> the scurvy mutt blocking our path to Pugnacious had the same self same dice, so he did. So, what are we waiting for? Let's go and tell him his, uh, his secret is out. No. He'll just deny it. So, it's better that he doesn't know we have it for now. Let's use it to get rich. <laughs> I see where you're going. Very crafty. I like it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then, he <laughs> he, tidy. We're over just like, what are you saying? You're, you're just you're saying random nonsense. 
That's playing the flipping world, right? But, but... We really were? Huh. You know, it's a little risky, but I think it just might. Tidy! Tidy, that's decided then. Leave it to your old pal, Lofty. Go pay Gary. Gary... Who's Gary? I don't understand all these British euphemisms. To play this at some point and get UK and Chad to be like, hey, explain stuff to me. You guys are weird. Oh, I mean, in a bad way. But it makes more sense than half the things that we say. Right, that's the casino. We're not going to the casino. We're going to the gatekeeper. We on a mission from God. Well, technically it's a kingmaker, so not, not wrong. I mean, he is a little tiny god, a deity of sorts. The power of deity, from what I've heard. Red. Hmm. Come to repay your debt, I assume. You owe me! Oh you gosh, do Bill. No, I've come to play another round. Very well. To wish, but you know you should lose for a fourth time. Your debt will grow still further. I'm not losing this time. I'll be counting on you. You think Lofty can, uh, Lofty can uh, sidetrack it? Sweet. So, which one will it be? Uh, red. <laughs> Time to put our little plan into action. Let us begin. No! He just flicked with the booger. Oh, that's impossible! Woohoo! <laughs> Alright, he just flicked a booger at it. What? What deception is this? You manipulate the dice. You must have. Really? How have we done that exactly? It's yours and you rolled it. Are you saying you had some nasty little trick up your sleeve and it didn't work, hmm? Ridiculous. I, little trick. No, I... You have no proof. How dare you? Hmm? What is all this noise? Hmm? Hey, big pug. What's up? That's pernicious. Hmm. Well, well, what exactly is going on here? You know better than to cause a scene so close to his eminence's private chambers. Master Pugnacious, how glad I am to meet you at last. We were sent here by uh, on urgent business by Niao. Yeah. But your stupid gatekeeper has tricked us into owing him a fortune. He still won't let us in. Is this how Goldpaw treats his guests? Goodness. Forgive my foolish underling. If my good friend Niao sent you, I have, it can be no traveling matter. That much should have been plain. You! And to resort to your base deceit and unforgivable transgression, you'll be, be given a raise later. Your debts will be annulled, of course. Goodbye. But this is no place to talk. We will continue inside. This one. Throw him in jail. Yes, master. I was just doing what you told me. <laughs> Throw him in jail because he was caught. And no one gets caught in my town. Thank everyone for joining me. Thanks for hanging out. For more news information on what's going on, what may be, check out the description below. If you like what you saw, want to see more, like it, slap the like button, bash the subscribe button, and share the video. Expand the Slackers universe because visibly is our greatest foe. And I will see you next time. On Ninu Kuni 2. I forgot what the name was for a second. It's like. I want to say Ninu Kunai, but. That's ninjas. We're not ninjas here. Maybe. Bye, folks.